All right, so welcome back to the tutorial. If you'll recall, um, in this report, what we did is we used NL first to look up data in another table. And one of the thoughts I ended the conversation with is that a lookup doesn't actually mean filter. That's not the same thing. In this version of the report, I'm saying, oh, I want to see all of my sales shipments, and I want to see, or I want to look up what country it went to. But what if you had a different reporting need? What if the reporting need was to say, I only want to see items, or I only want to see transactions where the, um, where the ship to country region code was Great Britain. I need to filter this data. Now there's, I'll call it a sloppy way of doing it. There's a, there's a way that some people do it where they'll say, okay, I'm gonna run the report and if column G contains a GB, then show the row, and if it doesn't, then we'll hide it. This is called a conditional hide. And I call it sloppy um, because technically, I have to run this report for, let's say there's 5,000 records that meet my filter criteria, and then I use a conditional hide to only show the 15 rows that were shipped to Great Britain. So that's sloppy because I have to actually run 50,000 rows or 5,000 rows just to end up with you know 50 values. Um, but let me show you how to implement a conditional hide. So again, what we're looking at right now is a conditional hide. What I'll do for the conditional hide is in B1 or B A2, I'll type in a hide plus question mark. That's a keyword. And what it says is look in this column for the keyword hide. And if you see the word hide, then after I run the report, I will hide the row. So in this instance, my conditionals hide would say, if this column, sorry, yeah, if this column contains, oh, if only I could type. <laughs> if this column is equal to this value, then show the row. Otherwise, display the word hide. In this case, it's going to show the word show, but hypothetically, when it says DB, it's going to have the word hide. And because it has the word hide in the conditional hide column, JET will automatically hide this row. Let's take a look. So I run my report, and this time I only end up with <laughs> 22 values, but notice all of these hidden rows, 51 through 66, uh, doo -doo 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 -doo, 50 to 48, 48 to 36, right? These are all conditionally hidden rows, and I can just right click and unhide, and I can see here, oh, look at all this stuff that went to, is that Czech, Austria, Germany, Belgium, and then just Great Britain. This is why I call it a sloppy filtering technique, because technically it's not filtering, it's just hiding a row. Um, so that was conditional hide to only show the rows where um, the column G contains GB.